Hello, ladies, gentlemen, and everyone else. We are gathered here to holy fatrimony to bring together Nick Avocado and his beautiful husband, Orlin Guacamole. I don't know his last name. Oh. <clears throat> Yeah, don't blame the dress, blame your mouth. Now why do you think I want to say I do? Because I'm being a bond. Get out of my get out of my wife! Get my right. You get, get my flowers! Stop it! These are my flowers! flowers. Yes, you heard that correctly. They are recreating their beautiful marriage as well as recreating the diarrhea they, they had. We're back again, looking at your boy, Thikocado Avocado. For some reason, these two Teletubbies decided that they want to recreate their beautiful marriage on camera and then eat some hot stuff. Honestly speaking, I haven't watched past the first minute of this video, so I'm watching it for the very first time with you guys. I saw him in the dress and I was like, this is enough. I already love it. They are very entertaining characters and I would love to be a part of the wedding. Quite frankly, I am appalled that I was not invited. Just because I don't know you, it doesn't mean that you shouldn't invite me. <laughs> if you want to subscribe, become a yeah. big baby, and maybe one day we can mock, mock, bang, mock, bang, mock, bang, mock, bang, mock, bang, bang. I probably shouldn't have said it like that. Sorry about that. Nick and Orlin, I just want to apologize in advance. I'm kind of in a prickly mood. Not because of you guys at all. Reason, unspecified. Feeling, unjustified. Hotel, Travago. All right, you big babies, let's get our suits, dresses, and everything else ready and attend this beautiful mukbang wedding. Oh! Out of my way. I have nothing to wear. Nothing fits. Because you're fat. I'm skinny. <sighs> we just started the video, Nick. Why is this the angle that you have chosen to represent yourself? Don't know if we have any film students out here, but this is the classic reverse dick pic angle. <laughs> um... <laughs> this this is not the right angle to take any video from. I have nothing to wear for my wedding. This is out of control. This this is a um, dilemma. You okay? Ah yes, the wedding stress of not being able to fit into a wedding dress. This, this is, is um, dilemma. dilemma. I find that very adorable how he can smash two words together. I'm sorry, I shouldn't be too harsh on the bride. Let's see what else he has to say. Ooh, here comes my bride. It doesn't fit. It doesn't matter if it doesn't fit. We Nothing have to get married. Fits. You're, You're ruining out. my wedding. It's my wedding too. Call your corporate. I'm sorry, can you call corporate on a wedding? Where do you just call your boss and you're like, hey, this dress doesn't fit. And your boss is like, did, did you getting married? I didn't even. Either way, Nick and Orlin are in rare form as usual, fighting about nothing. Nick cannot fit into the dress. That is the big dilemma, pun not intended. Oh, here comes my fat wife. Orlin, stop! I'm being honest. You're supposed to respect marriage and be I'm honest. Skinny! <laughs> Bro, Orlin must really like his food well cooked because he roasts Nick so often. He just called him my fat wife. Usually that ends in divorce, but this might be the only couple in existence to break up more times than they got back together and still be together. I mean, if they had a Guinness World Record for breakups, Orlin and Nick would be, they'd be at the top. Here comes my wife. Now hold in your cheek so you don't poop on it. Squeeze them real tight. Oh! <laughs> There's no stopping Orlin. Hey, my beautiful fat wife. Hold in them big fat butt cheeks so you don't shit yourself. Why don't I get some tape for your hole in case you shit yourself? Because it would be very evident from the back if you yourself we would know hey nick i got a joke for you if you poop yourself at the altar it's called holy shit. <laughs> olin really comes through with a fire man we some tight sweetie stop sweet. you're my you're my wife yeah, this is how I imagine most weddings to be. You know, when I turned up for this wedding that I wasn't invited to, this is exactly what I imagined. It's not a Nikocado and Olin wedding if the bride doesn't beat the groom up with a bouquet. That's just how it looks. Put it back. I don't.
Where's click the link below to get a personalized five to eight minute long video just for you. We can also DM each other too. Link below for my cameo. <laughs> what a crazy transition that was. I didn't cut that in any way. He was just in the middle of cussing out Olin and it just went to his cameo advert. Honest to God, I need to start doing that more with my stuff. You suck, you suck, you suck. What? You suck, you suck. What did you say? You suck, you suck, you suck. What are you calling me? Fat. Yeah, I said you suck. I will end you. you I will you end suck, your you family. Suck, you I will suck, nuke you suck, you your suck, whole family you suck, you in the butthole. Suck, no, suck, don't even talk. Hi guys, 16leo here. Follow me on Instagram at 16leo underscore. I will be so happy if you do. I'll give you a DM. <laughs> I did two takes of that because I couldn't get through the first one. Look at my wife. Look at my wife. Don't have to respect your husband. I, I am your husband. Hey, I am your husband. Alexa, this doesn't even fit. Doesn't sound like a problem Alexa can fix, but maybe Suri can. Hey Suri, do I look fat? I think you're great just the way you are. <laughs> hey Siri, does my ass look big? That's not nice. I think it's very nice. What the f are you talking about? Siri, do you want to date me? Mostly, I want to help and have interesting conversations. So dating then. Siri, I want to break up with you. I'm not sure I understand. Yeah, I didn't think you would. You have not been giving me the attention that I want recently. And quite frankly, you're kind of emotionless, so. Siri, I want a divorce. I'm sorry. Me too. When is off because I don't even fit in my dress! Because you can't stop eating. Yeah, don't blame the dress, blame your mouth! <laughs> Dude got shook by a fact. <laughs> you can't stop eating. You can't stop eating. Can't stop eating. Can't stop eating. What do you mean? I actually care about our wedding. I care I'm practicing my entrance. I love how him walking sounds like a train going through a tunnel. The sound effect is uncanny. Now why do you think I want to say I do? Because I'm beautiful. Uh, no, I just want your money. Well, at least he's honest. I gotta be honest, for a bride, this is a very unconventional dress. He got on some flip flops and knee high socks, <laughs> short pants. A black t-shirt and over it he looks like he took a curtain from his house and just wrapped it around his shoulders and then it looks like a dress that he got from his mom's wardrobe. I mean honestly bro this is like a Trum Trum DIY wedding dress at this point. Shh! Sit! You're ruining my wedding! It's my wedding too! This is my wedding! You're ruining my wedding! Sit and be merry and happy! Hi guys, I'm getting married Shh, too. Shh, don't be fake. Yeah, come on guys, don't be fake. I will uh, 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 stop being fake guys, come on. We gotta be real. Uh, uh, uh. I'm gonna eat some real food that I really did on my wedding. This is a real wedding. Uh, uh, uh. Olin, stop being fake, you fake. Olin, stop from normal time. Stop, uh, give me my flowers. You, you give, give me my, my flowers. flowers. I pay for stop it. it. My stomach hurts. You I'm gonna have diarrhea. You, mean, you always have diarrhea. Oh my gosh, I have gas. Let's just do this. I have gas. You now kiss the bride. My said. There's little poop on your arm. Where? <gasps> oh my god, I forgot to wipe myself. <gasps> oh. You know how sometimes people tell amazing stories at weddings about how they met? <clears throat> This is not one of them. You know, Nick fakes a lot of things. The one thing that he seems to keep real is the poop. Why, why is this man a feces machine? Why does he constantly shit himself? Do they not have two ply in their house or three ply or four ply? Could they reply to any of my tweets telling them to get some two ply, please? They don't want to hear about this. In my defense, it was on the seat because you left it on the seat. It's not my fault that when you, you go on the toilet, it just goes every like. Have you seen that hippo when it wags its tail? I got poop on my wedding dress. And I was gonna return that too. Smell it. Get it. Does anybody see a reason why these two people should not be together? If so, raise your hand. 
All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. Ouch, my socket. <laughs> Look, do you see this? This is what I have to put up with. These types of stains are everywhere. They're all over the wall. <laughs> so one of the staples every time I watch a Nick a video is he gets hurt uh, <laughs> he gets hurt mid-sentence and then has to cry for like a period of five seconds then he's back to normal he was talking so hard his socket came out oh my socket <laughs> Anyway, guys, we're eating Twizzlers today. Everywhere. They're all over the walls. They're all over the bathroom. They're everywhere. It's your fault. It's your fault. Hey, it is not my fault that your bathroom looks like a Jackson Pollock painting. I don't do this. You do. And then when you go to the bathroom, you have the hippo poop and you go like this with your tail and it goes everywhere. It's such a... And I feel like you can do with the bathroom curtains because there's stuff all over the bathroom curtains. And I don't know why you do it with the bathroom curtains, but they're full of it. The bathroom curtains are full of it. Siri, I have diarrhea. I don't understand. It's when I have diarrhea. That I could I'm sorry, what did you say? Diarrhea? Why did you say it like that, Siri? Why did you say diarrhea? Siri, my two fat friends are fighting. I found this on the web. Your fat friends need you as an ally. This is how you can be one. A B C. How to support your fat friends as a straight size person. Wow. <laughs> okay. I guess Siri does help. That's when I'm cleaning myself out. I don't go to the bathroom in the in the shower. That's when I pump the hose in there. I'm sorry, you got a hose in your bathroom? That sounds like a rap lyric. I got a hose in my bathroom. Like what the f are you talking about, bro? What? It is not normal to have a hose pipe in your bathroom. That is for the garden, my friend. I feel like if someone had to check Nikogato's bathroom, it'd be like a crime scene. I'm imagining it. Ah! I'm having my bad man, so I'm having to bring no honor to our marriage. They don't like you, but no one likes you. No one likes you. Let's be honest, that is what everybody wants to hear from their husband on their marriage day. Nobody likes you. I don't like you. We're gathered here today to stunt on you. I got down on one knee to tie my shoelace. This is not a real marriage. This is April Fool's, baby. Why you think this marriage was held on April the 1st? Think about it. I'm all in guacamole and you're on punked. They know you're a Walmart girl. They know you're a Walmart girl. I am a girl. You ain't no girl. Yes. How dare you say you're a girl? Don't call yourself a girl. What? I'm a girl. I'm a girl. I am a girl. I'm a girl. I'm a squirrel. I'm a whirlpool. What is it to you? What's Sir, can you please you? stop doing that? My wedding food is going cold. You're too cheap to get a wedding cake. You just have to get in the macaroni with food dye because you're too cheap for a <laughs> wedding cake. Oh, this whole time I thought these were Twizzlers or something. I was like, they look a bit strange. Why did he dye the macaroni red? What? What tradition is this? Hey, my name's Thikakado Avocado. Welcome to my wedding. We got some red macaroni and I got some blue balls. All in, can you come and suck it? <laughs> Have you been in my shoes? Do you know how much I, I weigh? I fit in your shoes. Your shoes are this big. Oh my <laughs> <laughs> I knew he was gonna set him up, but this is just... The exaggeration, your shoes are this big, you f***ing fat person. <laughs> They're like the same size. If they both got onto the same elevator, it would just go down no matter what floor they pressed. <laughs> yeah, do you know what that, you know what big shoes means? You're a fat person, that's what it means. <laughs> you know what they say about big shoes. It means you're fat. <laughs> Yeah, you couldn't even let Nick have just this one thing. And I know Nick Akato sometimes is a detestable person, but <laughs> I feel bad for him at times, man. You are going to be so single in a minute. You guys, today we're doing mac and cheese for our wedding. Very normal wedding. Mm. Because we're normal people. Mm. Uh, how do you use these big... Mm. This is my favorite part of Nikocado. No matter how angry he is, as soon as he starts eating, that melodies come out, bro. He goes from Nikocado to Dracocado, right there. He's like, oh. mm -hmm. Orlin, can you pass me the cheese? Please. Just melodies come out of his mouth and something else out of his ass, but it is crazy. I love it. You literally have poop on your arm. <laughs> 
Orlin. What the hell is wrong with you, you toddler? Wipe your arm. People are like, you have shit on your arm, so he's like, oh no. <laughs> Why are you so happy about this? I'm about to expose a YouTuber, you guys. On my wedding day. Oh my God. I will be exposing a big YouTuber and it's a male. I'll tell you that much. Oh my God, I'm a male. Big YouTuber. Millions of followers. Uh, <laughs> I'm in the clear, baby. Don't touch me. <laughs> filthy, filthy mittens you have for arms. They look like baseball mitts. <laughs> I'm gonna go blind. Because of your diabetes. You know what the sad thing about this is? And I keep thinking about it is that when they started their mukbangs together, first of all, they probably were kind of normal and they didn't do this fake fighting on camera. And then for whatever reason, Nick was like, hey, punch me. Like, I don't know if that's what he said, but um, something happened where they faked it on camera. And then people started watching it and they're like, oh, damn, not only is this man eating a lot, but he does not seem to like his partner. And you know, negative things get a lot of attention on YouTube. And then it seems like they just grew from that instead of like a little love tap. He was like, get the chair, get the steel chair, just me over the head with it. I, it just keeps growing and growing and escalating. And now every video they have is why I broke up, why we're back together, why we're getting married, divorced, cheating. It's like a little drama series where they just eat. I'm watching it just as entertained as everyone else. I just hope people don't get bored of it. That's all. I'm sure they won't. I'm just saying. First and foremost, water weight is a real thing. Ask, stop. It's just water because of sodium. Sodium retains water and carbohydrates too. Oh my God, he's right. When we eat too much salt, the body retains extra sodium, which increases the amount of fluid in the body. Nick Cotto, you smart mother fluffer. I guess that's why he's so salty. I set that joke up. What are you gonna do about it? So you're telling me that your double shit is all water? Yes! Poppy my water weight. I already made one of those videos. I remember it was coming out of your feet. Oh yeah, we never posted that. That is disgusting. What? You mean you someone poked his feet and water came out? You should get that checked by, uh... A pool inspector? I don't, what, who do you go to? Can you imagine these two calling a plumber and he comes to their home and he's like, where's the leak? And Nick's like, it's right over here, bro. They know exactly what you're talking about. You're too obvious. Who, who the hell chews like that? Is there really a person who chews like that? That look, that doesn't look right. <laughs> stop, stop doing it. What the f***? Bro, this is like a big head on crack. NSFW. Try this piece, it has cheese. Shoot. Okay, you need to stop. This is, we are having a wedding. Everybody is sanctioned here to eat the food, not throw it up. Just chill with the damn I'm chewing. I don't know if you're talking about Pac-Man himself, but that is the only person that I think can eat at that velocity with that mouth speed. Uh, I don't know if you have beef with an arcade machine. I really don't even care. Just please stop chewing like that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, Nick has an OnlyFans. Mm -hmm. You know what, without Olin, this is just a very boring video of a overweight man eating with two spoons. At least one thing remains consistent, his eating is disgusting as ever, and I don't think the video could get more disgusting. <laughs> I stand corrected. Well, thank you guys so much for watching my wedding. It was very fun. And you can keep on in the loop to know what's going on with my health. Thank you, and goodbye. Well, that was an anticlimactic ending. I was hoping that uh, they would run away at the altar, but then I realized they're not running. I was, I was kind of hoping for something wedding themed to end the video. Damn it, Nick. I was here for the wedding. I dressed up in my, my suit. I brought my date. Hey Siri, are you my date? She's my date. I even wrote a speech that you didn't allow me to give at your wedding. <clears throat> Here is to the bride and groom. Since I have known them, absolutely nothing has changed and I have regretted it every day that I have known them. May you have peaceful life somewhere far away from here. Um, cheers, but you probably already drank 
the champagne in my glass. Love, 16 Leo. <clears throat> With that being said, that is all I have time for today. However, they did actually upload a second wedding video which I would like to go through with you guys if you'd like that. So uh, if you do, then leave a comment down below. This is the first YouTube wedding I have been to. I hope that it's not the last. Until then, you guys, I'm just going to be here trying to get them chewing sounds out of my head. So I shall see you very soon for the next one. Thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate it. Take care of yourself. Stay safe. Buffs. Yeah, sometimes they call me Bert. Pretty in my city.